Now you want to scroll down to apply clothing and attachments. Select it. And at this point, you should see Franklin along with the jewelry on him. All right. He's going to have his bracelet. He's going to have his um, watch and his rings. He's going to have earrings. everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already go ahead and click that red button right there and also click that bell for notifications and select all all right yo schemes and graphics we're picking up building with another gta 5 mod tutorial for you and today we are going to do a updated video on installing all ice everything all right this is the mod that gives franklin um or trevor or um michael jewels you actually get the chains you get some rings some bracelet watches you even get some nice cool glasses and of course some nice gold teeth all right and uh earrings as well all right so all this comes with this this is created by red shout out to the creator when you get down to this page what you want to do is read the full description here all right definitely read the full description after you're done reading the full description, come over here where it says current and select the green arrow to download. Now let's go ahead and jump into requirements. We are going to need open for uh, scriptbook v, scriptbook v.net, and we will also need menu. Okay, so all of those requirements we're going to need. We are not installing the requirements. I will leave the links down in the description to videos showing you how to install those requirements if you don't have them already. So make sure that you check all the links in the description. Once you have your requirements installed and you have your all ice everything downloaded. On my left hand side, I have one download. As you can see, it is all ice everything. And on my right hand side, I have my open four opened up and ready to go. I have all of my requirements installed. Um, before we get started in open forward, make sure that you have your edit mode turned on. It's this little button right here. Now that you have that turned on, um, if this is your first time installing any type of mod, make sure that you have a mods folder. If you don't have a mods folder, just come up here where it says create new folder and create a new folder and name it mods in lowercase. All right. Once you have that all set, let's go over to the all ice everything folder and open it up inside here we are going to have four folders that we are installing okay it's going to be four of them all right um the first one is extra fun which is optional okay this is optional but this one menu outfit mod and ymt we are definitely installing okay so let's go ahead and start off with the menu outfit let's open up the menu outfit inside menu outfit it is going to be one xml file it's going to say all ice everything all right let's leave this open let's navigate over to our open four which is our gta 5 directory right here and as you can see you could go through menu stuff folder right here through open four so open up the menu stuff folder then we want to open up um, our outfit okay open up the outfit folder then we're going to take all ice everything and just drag and drop it right over here and you should see it being placed right at the top now that that is dropped let's go ahead and select gta 5 at the top and that's going to bring us back to the gta 5 directory let's head back over to our all ice everything folder press the back arrow now let's go into the mod okay open up the mod folder inside all ice everything inside here we are going to have two folders all right now let's go ahead and navigate over to open four and i'll show you exactly where everything is going all right so let's go ahead and start off with um our sunglasses and earrings okay so we need to go in the side column down here and select x64 v so when you get to x64 v there should be a red banner that says show in mods folder or copy to mods folder if you don't have it already in your mods folder so go ahead and select copy to mods folder once that has been copied to mods folder, you want to go and select models, CD images, and then scroll down and we're going to select streamed pet props dot RPF. Open that up. Then we want to scroll down until you see player one P. Okay. It's going to be at the bottom player one P open that up. 
Now let's go back over to our mod folder that we had opened up inside of our all ice everything folder. And we want to select the first one that says streamed pet props dot RPF player underscore one underscore P. We want to open up that folder. This is going to be our props our sunglasses. All right. And let's go ahead and take all of these files I have highlighted and we're going to drag and drop that over here to open four. All right. So you're just dragging and dropping and that's it. You could um, select the back arrow to go back and in open four, select the back arrow to go back one time right there and then press it one more time. We just want to press it twice to go back. Now we want to go and navigate to streamed peds underscore players dot RPF. Open that one up. Then we want to select player underscore one. Open that up. Now we're going to go back over to our mod folder inside of our all ice everything folder. We're going to open up the stream peds underscore players dot RPF player underscore one. Open up that folder. It's going to be a lot of files in here. What you want to do is just press control A on the keyboard. Control A on the keyboard will select everything inside this folder. And we want to drag and drop everything over here to open four. This might take some time to uh, copy over. Just be patient and wait. When that is done, you go ahead and press the back arrow. Press file and open four and close all archives. It's going to bring us back to the GTA 5 directory right here. All right. Now let's go back to our all ice everything folder. We had installed the menu outfit. We installed all of the jewelry. Now let's install the YMT file. Okay. So let's navigate back over. Let's open up the YMT and then navigate back over to our open four. And the YMT file is going to be going here in the update. Select the update right here in the side column. Once you select update, select X64, then select DLC packs. Then you want to scroll down and select patch day 3NG. Okay, patch day 3NG. Select that. And then you want to select DLC.RPF. There's going to be a red banner. It's going to say copy to mods folder. Go ahead and select copy to mods folder. Once that's been copied to the mods folder, select 64. Then um, you want to select models, then see the images, then patch day 3ng.rpf. So it's going to be this one right at the top. Then you want to come over here to your YMT folder and select the player one YMT file. And we're going to drag and drop that right over here until open four. All right, drag and drop. Once that has been dragged and dropped, we are all good to go. Now, just in case you wanted to install that extra, the extra is going to be a money phone. Okay. If you wanted to install that extra, this is what you do. You're good from here. Okay. This is just optional from here for the extra fun folder. All right. Just, it's just optional. You want to go back to your open four. Then we're going to navigate over here to X64 C. Okay. X64 C. You want to go ahead and select that, then you will see a red banner pop up. Select copy to mods folder. Once that's been copied to the mods folder, select levels, then select GTA 5. Then you want to select props. Then select LEV underscore DES Lev Des. You want to select this folder. Then you want to select Lev underscore Des dot RPF. And then we want to go back to our all ice everything folder and open up the extra fun folder. And inside there is going to be one file. We want to select that one file, drag and drop it over to open four. All right. So now that we have everything installed, we can go ahead and select file, close all archives, minimize any of the windows that we might have open and run the game. Once you spawn into the game, what we need to do now is open up menu. Okay, that's the first thing we want to do is open up menu. Press F8 twice to open up menu. We want to scroll down to player options, then select wardrobe. All right, you can go ahead and select front view. That way we can keep the camera angled at Franklin. Scroll down to outfits. 
and then scroll down till you find all ice everything dot XML select it now you want to scroll down to apply clothing and attachments select it and at this point you should see Franklin along with the jewelry on him all right it's gonna have his bracelet it's gonna have his um, watch and his rings he's gonna have earrings and the glasses also that came with it now in order to get to the chains let's go ahead and back out back out again scroll all the way down to emblem okay scroll to emblem and we're gonna keep going down to 15 okay it's gonna be 15 through 24 I believe okay so this is where you find his chains okay you're gonna find the chains in emblem all right all of this information will be included in the readme and the download of all ice everything okay so once you download all ice everything it comes with a readme please read the readme so you can understand exactly where the bracelet and the watch and the rings go and the chains well i'm showing you the chains right now but just to get a clear idea where everything goes please read the read me all right so we're going through the chains right now this is 15. some of them do have uh different textures like 15 has uh gold and uh silver so you could uh switch in between gold and silver for that one for 15 and then 16 is going to have two chains you can make those gold or silver as well Let's go to 17. 17 is the big chain right here, the big gold chain. It has two textures as well, gold and silver. Then 18, you have the gold rope and you have silver and gold for that one as well. 19 is uh, the chop um, and LS chains. Those right there have uh, another texture as well. This is silver, then it has uh, one with silver and gold. All right, and then one with a little black in it too as well. All right, this one has like a few little textures in this one. All right, so um, next one is going to be 20. Um, if you change the textures on this, this actually just has one texture. It doesn't have any textures you could change. It's just this one. Then uh, let's go to 21. 21 is the G unit chain right here. Um, this one, you can remove the cross and you can add in yb which is young bucks chain or you could um, have the games chain the black wall street chain from game the rapper and you can have the nwa and black wall street chain all right so you can switch off uh, different chains that you want there's also a terror squad chain right here also that you can wear all right so it's uh 21 actually comes with um one two three four five six about six different styles of chains that you can wear all right 22 22 um doesn't have any other textures it's just this right here and 23 is going to be the statue of liberty all right this one has um one other texture it's uh silver and then the other one is silver and gold on the chain and the next chain up is going to be this cross right here let's see about the other textures this has silver and gold as well for the chain and that is it right there all right and it also uh changes the whole chain into gold as well real quick i want to show you the phone all you got to do is just pull out your phone and there you go you have your money phone as you can see Frank is looking at money right now. All right. If you wanted to um, uninstall the money phone, just go ahead and go in your mods folder, delete x64c archive. Okay, that's x64c. You want to delete that if you want to uninstall the money phone. So this is it. And this is how you install all ice everything all right if you follow the directions carefully you should be able to find all of um, franklin's new jewelry without any issues all right so if this helps y'all out to install it or if you just enjoyed the video feel free to smash that like button for me definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and share the video with your friends that are in the modding gta 5 y'all this game's a graphics me a big ball and ass frank we out of here till next time yo I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.